The report tells us that in the last decade, one million boys have fallen behind girls by the age of five because of delays in their early language development. And now boys are twice as likely to be behind girls at this age. So I want you to have a look at these things for me. I'm going to ask you to remember them. Yeah, you've had a good old look. A unicorn. A crayon. An onion. A toy train. Well done! And I'll tell you what, Evan remembered all of them, but he didn't remember the banana. Right. Bella's play was really full of narrative and of themes and of people and that's quite sophisticated for her play and that shows that her imagination skills and her language skills are really very well developed. Evan was much more physical and enthusiastic in his play and he had a rocket but it was much more simplistic and it was much more cause and effect. So his play skills have got some areas to develop and we can see how they're going to develop into the type of play that we saw Bella doing. Well there's lots of things that parents and families can do with their children and the most simplest vital thing is to talk to them, talk with them, tell stories, sing nursery rhymes, play games that involve conversation and chatting. So make language part of everyday life. Describe what you're doing. Pick activities where you have to explain what's going on. Baking, playing, water play. All of these are fantastic opportunities to bring language every day into what you're doing.